welcome back to my channel. My name is Fiu and I am living and working in Germany. And today I am doing a what I spend in a week living and working in Germany. So I'm going to cover several categories like groceries, transportation, eating out, leisure time activities and subscriptions. And I'm just going to show you a really average work week in my life. And I would say let's jump right into it, shall we? So Monday after work I went to get some groceries and for this tomatoes, cucumber bread and six eggs I paid 5 euro 32 or up roughly five dollars. After that I went to the post to send a birthday card for about 70 cents. After that I headed to my gym where I have a monthly subscription of about 20 euros so I paid 5 euros this week. So on Tuesday during working hours I didn't spend anything because I was eating home cooked food for lunch and basically just work. In the evening me and my boyfriend spontaneously went for some coffee. So I got a cappuccino which cost 3 euro 60 so roughly about the same in dollars. And as I was already quite hungry because I have to get up early, I had to order something small to eat. So I got a tomato soup with some warm pizza dough balls. The soup was about 6 euro 50 which is quite expensive for a soup, but it was quite nice once I had taken off the cream. On Wednesday I didn't spend anything, so let's just straight away jump to Thursday. I forgot to mention that I take the train to work. I've got a monthly pass that covers the whole network and it costs 133 euro and 99 cents. So my weekly cost is 33 euro and 47 cents or roughly 36 dollars. At work I had coffee but I had already paid for the powder and milk so I'm not counting that. During lunch break I went for a little walk. And then I had my favorite pre-prepped vegan salad, which was 2 euro 99 or roughly 3 dollars. For dessert, I had a slice of cheesecake that one of my co-workers made and brought along for the team. As I didn't spend anything on Friday and just got horizontal, we can skip in and directly jump to Saturday. We took a train and the day ticket was 7.40 to go to another city where I had a brow appointment. And I almost forgot to record my cabrese sandwich and I was already munching on it and this is why it looks like that. As I already had the coupon for the brow appointment, I paid nothing on this occasion. After the appointment, we went to a cute little cafe. And as it is still quite chilly outside, I bought myself a hot chocolate which was 3 euro 40. And as my sugar cravings were not satisfied yet, I decided to also get a hot chocolate in white, so a white hot chocolate, which cost about 20 cents more than the ordinary one, but was only half as good. In the evening I quickly popped into the grocery store and bought these few items for what I find quite a lot of money. On Sunday I asked my boyfriend to cut my hair again. I don't have any special cut so I don't see the point of spending 40 euro plus just to get a straight cut. I'm happy to save on this because you know a girl's life is expensive and there's so many other expenses coming up but I'm really considering getting blonde highlights again. It's been some years since I grew them out and my hair didn't improve in the way I wanted so yeah that's just a thought that I keep in mind. It turned out to be a little shorter than what I actually wanted, but hey, I didn't pay anything for it and my destroyed tips were gone. On Sunday we also went for a walk and I had to disappoint this cute little guy because there was nothing else than my finger to munch on and yeah, that was already the week. So now it's time to do the math at the end of the week and after adding all my expenses the grand total of the week is 94 euros and 84 cents or 101 dollar and 64 cents so yeah i mean that was one week in my life pretty average work week as i said some weeks tend to be more expensive like when um i go and eat out properly which i didn't do this week or i or when i go on a day trip but yeah that's just one example of my daily life and my weekly expenses and yeah 
cry in the comments below whether you thought it would be higher or lower or what you were expecting. So guys, that's already it. If you found that interesting, make sure to leave me a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I would really love, I would really love to see you back here on my channel again. And make sure to send this video to somebody who might find it interesting. Let me know if you like this kind of content so I can make some video like that again in the future or maybe uh, what I spend in a month at some point. And otherwise, let's catch up very soon again. See you. Bye.